Well, hello guys. In this video, I'll show you how to fix the black screen of your Windows 7 PC, uh, which is kind of like not working. All the desktop icons you see here have um, stupid icons, uh, not the regular ones. And uh, if you try to click the taskbar, then it doesn't respond at all. So you have a pretty useless computer here in the background, which you can't use. The whole problem is, um, is uh, because of the update you did. You did an update from Windows 7 to Windows 10. And because Microsoft is, in my opinion, most of the times doing a pretty bad quality assurance on their products, this is what you get when you use Windows PC. Anyways, I'll try to fix this now and uh, you can fix it. The problem is that your previous installation of Windows 10 didn't run completely. So um, it got stuck somewhere. The system didn't tell it to you. And uh, now you are left with this useless computer here. As already mentioned before, you have the problem that when you click on the Windows icon here, nothing happens and you can't open any programs and everything gets stuck. So you're, you are left with a completely useless computer. To fix this problem, um, you need a Windows 10 USB stick or, as in my case, a Windows 10 installation disk you have. When you see the screen, you should be able to open the Explorer. That's the only thing that should work. Um, so you click on the Explorer icon and you get an overview of your um, of your PC. And here, now you switch to the DVD, um, the DVD device or to your USB um, stick with a Windows 10 copy on it. And after you do this, um, you see a setup um, data file, which you can execute when you right click on it and tell the system to open it as administrator. Before you do that, plug in a cable for internet, um, because at the moment we are very likely not um, able to connect to your Wi-Fi. So use a cable connection instead. Then you uh, click on the button, start it as, min as administrator, um, confirm the next pop-up and from then on your Windows installation will start and um, will go on from where it stopped at the previous installation. After a short waiting time you'll get this uh, window here where the system asks you to, um, to get important updates. At the moment I will say no, don't do it yet and uh, I won't like to help to make Windows 10 better because there is so much to do that I would be dead if I had finished this stupid system. Go and use Mac. So from now on, um, the system uh, will restart the update process. This routine will restart and reinstall everything from Windows 10, which has failed before. And after this, your computer will restart normally again. Um, it's all um, depending with the 1803 update. So I have to go on and enter my product key. That's something that shouldn't be interesting to you. And um, yeah, uh, just follow this guide and click through it. After that, your computer will restart and you can use everything. Um, disclaimer on my side. Um, I'm pretty sure that this um, routine doesn't delete any of your data on your PC, uh, but it's Microsoft. You, you can never be sure what happens. So this is my disclaimer. Do it on your own risk. But I fixed a few PCs with this problem doing exactly this routine. Well, after a few clicks on Next, your Windows will install Windows 10 and... Um, during this time, the PC will restart a few times. So um, don't mind if it um, shuts down and restarts. Just keep the power cable connected and everything should be fine. So here uh, it is, my evidence that everything worked. Uh, we have the same laptop here. And if I click on the Windows icon now, then the taskbar shows up as expected. Perfect. Everything finished. Yes, and one thing, um, please excuse this bad video quality. I just made it uh, after I fixed the third PC uh, with this problem. 
and I just wanted to help you. Normally I do better videos for photography, for travel and so on. So if this helped you, leave me a comment or even leave me a, a subscription to my channel. That would be very nice. Um, don't be too mad about your shitty PC. Have a nice day. See you next time.